POSITIVE UPDATE FOR YOU. LOCAL ROCK CLIMBING COACH WHO SURVIVED A DEVASTATING HIT ON CRASH IS IMPROVING AND OUT OF THE ICU, WHICH IS GREAT NEWS. KIM PUCHIO WAS ON HER WAY FROM A FRISCO GYM NEARLY TWO YEARS AGO. TONIGHT, OUR MARVIN HURST PROFILING THE EFFORTS AND NOW THE SUPPORT FROM THE COMMUNITY TO GET COACH KIM HOME. THERE IS A NEW CLIMB IN A PLACE WHERE SCALING THE WALLS IS NECESSARY. COME ON, HAZLEY! As climbers move skyward at Canyon Rocks Climbing in Frisco. Running out the time, stay on the wall as long as possible. Part of their coaching foundation almost got killed. When I get up there and I walk into the room, she's unrecognizable. Casey Pucci O'Gary rushed to a North Texas hospital on February 1st. Her mother, Kimberly Puccio, was injured to the point of dependency. Not being able to use hands. Not being able to wash yourself, drive, do your day to day things. The list begins with cuts across her forehead, blurred vision from a bloody retina, and a punctured lung. She has four broken ribs. Um, she's got a broken left wrist, a broken right hand, a, her forearm on her right side, literally broken half both bones and came out of the arms. The Texas DPS says Brandy Branson veered into the wrong lane on Highway 289 in Grayson County that night, smashing the vehicle head on and sending Puccio on the other side of the road where another vehicle hit her, even as a passerby tried to save her. She's a tough woman. <laughs> Parents and students from Canyon Rock moved into action. They see her daughter. She's put together a GoFundMe. Um, when we found out about the news, we are instantly looking for ways to get money together from other team parents. On Monday night, Coach Kim's young climbers started sending her messages of hope and love on posters for Valentine's Day. The messages come as their coach is out of ICU and now makes steps towards recovery, knowing this is a steep climb, but she can make it. Marvin Hurst, CBS News, Texas. Well, we're thinking about her and the we family. We sure are. And real quick on the way in, I misspoke saying this happened two years ago. This happened two weeks ago. So apologies on that.